let's see what have we got here i've got vitamins and i've got vitamins so vitamins better work or we're fucked vitamins don't work <laughs> Hey, what is going on guys? It is Lachlan here and welcome back to a brand new episode of Stranded Deep and this is going to be a back-to-back -back episode. We did an episode yesterday, doing an episode today. Why the fudge not? You guys seem to enjoy the series and seem to absolutely love it, so I might as well go ahead and reward you guys with another episode for the massive amount of support you guys have given this channel. In the next couple of days, you guys will see a lot of episode ones coming out on the channel and that is mainly to do with me testing a lot of other games that I should play on this channel and your general reaction. Uh, to those videos will determine what uh, you know regularly gets posted on this channel, but uh, do not fear strand and deep will always be a staple part of this channel of, of this of this channel. This is what our house looks like. I didn't do much off screen apart from add um, this driftwood wall half here and got a little bit more materials. We're actually running low on everything. We're running low on corrugated scraps. We have some planks. We have some steel scraps. I want to try and finish this house. I want to put roofs on it. I want to make it all nice and professional, but that does take time and we're going to need to do a lot of resource gathering in today's episode. So first off, I'm thinking we'll probably go for a little bit of a fish here. We don't have any other food. I don't know where the crabs are at. The crabs have just disappeared this season altogether. Oh wait, we got to check our fish trap. You guys remember last episode, we put a fish trap over here. So we're going to find out what our big fancy reward is going to be. I have a feeling it's going to be probably nothing. Wh where is it? Where are my fish? Oh, wait, there it is. There it is. Wait, I think it's so. Yes, here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. It still has yet to catch anything. All right. We're going to have to talk about that. Fish trap. Why haven't you caught anything yet? Fish trap. You really didn't catch anything. That's very, very disgraceful. I think I have to send him deeper into the ocean and we'll have to. Yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll, we'll put him on the boat. And, uh, and then we'll drop him out in the ocean and then we'll go pick him back up. I want to stock up on as many materials as I can. So we're going to do a material run to start things off today's episode. Okay, I'm probably going to catch a couple more fish. I'll be back in a second, guys, with a whole bunch of fish. And we're going to start cooking them up and have a little, a little bit of a roast. All right, so yeah, I will miss the day when I actually like find some exotic fish for once. Like instead of finding these same old fish, the pilchard and salmons. I can't wait to find some really cool ones. Uh, so put this on the campfire. And we'll light that stuff up underwater because why the fudge not? Wait for these to cook and then I guess it's a full-fledged adventure to the couple of islands to find ourselves some resources. Also, I want to um, take acknowledgement of one other thing. A lot of people are saying, Lachlan, put another motor on your thing and turn them all at once. I don't think you can because as soon as you turn on a motor, you're stuck to it. So I don't know how I would turn on multiple ones. If that is a way and that is a thing, please let me know in the comment down below and I will try it because if that does actually make a thing and you can put three motors on it, then holy God, we're doing it. You know what I mean? Like it's happening. As for now, I just heard a big thing cook off over here. So we are going to eat all of these good, yummy cooked foods. All right, perfect. Um, well, let's grab all these bad boys and chuck them in the... See, I would love to get a pantry later on where I can put all my food, but as for now, this is the pantry, all right, guys? This is where I grab all my food when I need it. All right, I'm going to put buckets of water down. I'd love to get some shelves. I don't think we can make shelves. Let's make sure we're not carrying too much stuff that we don't need. I'll bring the boat motor even though it's pretty negligible. The hammer doesn't need to come with us. Uh, actually, no, I'll, I'll keep it just in case we need to build things on the fly. Uh, the oven ladder definitely does not need to come with us. I'll put that back on the oven. I guess it is off to start our next adventure. Wait, we still got to check to see if this thing will move with... Uh, I, I think it's going to be a problem with just even that little fish trap. It's going to be a problem. Yeah, look at that. I can barely even move the thing. That's so disrespectful. <laughs> this is a method that we've invented here with the magic raft. Having it to carry items between islands. And I wouldn't mind this to bring back some doors or whatnot. Because this is the only way I can do it right now. Um, so we just make sure I push that off right there. Get, come on, magic raft. You, you gotta go. Push it right in. Uh, a lot of people are also saying make it bigger so that it will actually fit the whole... This, this fish trap is bloody heavy. I can barely lift it. Such a difficult thing to put on. Alright, wait, 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 wait. And throw Oh, throw. oh, 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 you just can't win with this thing. You just can't win. Let's try there. Oh Got him. All right, perfect. Okay. Now we need to uh, Move this magic craft over here. So that's nice in the middle bit and then how the hell did my ship do that? I will never know it just turned completely a 360 all right, let's get him out of the sand. Look at that. That ship is sinking. Because, yeah, I want to bring back that stingray and maybe find new stingrays because we lost our stingray. <laughs> Hands through this bad boy. And then off we go. Uh, it's not exactly perfect. It's putting us on tilt. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We have to come into this thing. Okay, no, stop. Stop the boat motor. 
This thing has to be perfectly aligned. Think about there. I think that's about right. No, a little bit over here. Oh, it's moving the it's moving the raft now. They need to buff the fish trap because at the moment it's not really impressing me that much. It's just been a pain in the bum hole. All right, here we go. Oh, now it just shows we have a rock problem. And we, can, we can't turn with this thing on. Okay, that's it. We're, okay, there's a line. We're drawing the line here. Fish trap, come with me. You're coming with me. You're going in the ocean. Who knows if I'm coming back to get you? All right, you're going with the crude hammers. Honestly, like, you're that useless to me, and you're just being that much of a jag that you're going you're going deep in the sea. You're going with the... You're, go, you're swimming with the fishes, and I'm really happy you showed me this because there is a chest right here. Hello, fishy. Oh, we have duct tape. Thank you very much, fish trap. Oh, wait. Look, it's a rare fish. A lionfish. Oh, that looks really cool. All right, let's go back out of here. So yeah, the lionfish is like the default one. That should catch some fish that looks kind of deep. Hopefully, it will find something. And if it doesn't, well, then uh, it's just a bad, bad fish cage thing that I should never build. All right, I really shouldn't be holding this. I think it poisons you if you eat the lionfish. Let me know. I think you. I think it poisons you. We'll find out when I eat it, and it poisons me. Uh, as far as the magic wrath, I'm not sure if we're going to bring it with us. I guess we could... Hmm, we'll come back for it if we need it um, to bring things with us. There's the crude hammer. All right, this has been long delayed. I wanted to go ahead and farm some bloody resources. So I'll farm some bloody resources, but it's the last thing I do. I'm going off on an adventure in this direction. See you guys at that island. I'm still yet to find a whale this series either as well, which is kind of sad. Whales were the biggest hype thing last season. They, you'll see them from a mile away. They're so awesome. Or a great white shark. Or a swordfish. Or a turtle. We're missing a lot of, like, a lot of things. Oh, I've already been here. This is that place with that big container crate. Ah, uh, I'll ship starboard. I already, I've already been here. All right, so I've been sailing for about five minutes now. And uh, I'm a little concerned about the length of the motor. This island over here has started to appear. I've missed the whole oil rig thing. Whoa, it's getting real dangerous in the seas right now. It's real rocky. Real rocky. All right, this is a little scary. But we're approaching an island. Hopefully, we've got things here. Um, if not, we've... Uh, okay, there's a box. There's a red box over here. I think that means this could be the island where... Like, if there's a bed... If there's a bed on here... I think I've actually been to this island before. All right. So, if there's a little ship thing on this side that I know... I think there is a ship thing coming up on the right over here. So, this is the island where we first made um, part of the banter barrels, if I'm not mistaken. I'm mainly here on a supply run, though, like I said. So, if I can find... Any types of, uh, yeah, see, look, these are the, oh, it's crabs. I haven't seen crabs in ages. All right, crabbies. You're, you're, oh, wow, you're not even, I thought they were all dead crabs. No, you're coming home with me, buddy. Thanks, crabbies. But like I said, you aren't the biggest concern of mine. Yeah, see, look, there's a, there's a ship, ship wreck here. Um, if it's not looted, then that's just easy bangers, but I'm pretty dang sure it is by me. Yeah, see, it's already looted. And this is where I made the, that I took, I took the barrels off over here and made, um, what I made before. Damn, trying to go through this thing at night is scary. I'm just trying to check if there's any other things I left behind here on the ground. I think I remember leaving some things behind and just saying, like, oh, screw it, I'll come back for it. Yeah, here it is. Sticks and steel scraps. Um, anything else? No? Alright. Well, there's a trunk over here. I'm gonna break these up, because like I said, I am desperate for wood. Um, I would rather stick wood, though, like tree wood, than uh, driftwood, because obviously I can do more with the uh, stick wood, but I do need driftwood for the um, part of the house anyway, so I'll take whatever I can get. Foggy and raining. I've never had this before. It's so hard to keep track of where the hell you are, and even finding stuff on the ground is a massive pain. I keep getting food resources. I need god dang actual resources to build with here. Yeah, there's some trunks that I flipped over once. Alright, we're gonna head over to that next island, because I want to find some new stuff, and there is nothing here apart from a couple trees. Looks like we're pretty much full on inventory, and I think I'm going to head home before I die of Ebola that the stonefish is carrying. Oh, sorry, not stonefish, lionfish. We're going to head home, and while we head home, I'm going to um, double-check what is actually required to fix ourselves of fish Ebola. But before we do, there's a little wave here pointing towards something. Yeah, there's a shipwreck down there. All right. Um, let's put this down here and have a look what we're dealing with here. Oh... What do we got? It's gotta be something here. I ain't come down for nothing. Here we go, toolbox. Another la another label maker. Hell yeah, we didn't really need another one, but we'll take it. We will always take another one. All right, Um, but I need to now, oh, like, you can just, I I'm gonna bring you, no, I'm not gonna bring you home, but you're giving me like massive Ebola at the moment. Could you just not? Actually the worst. He looks like such a beautiful fish though. I want to bring him home just because he looks like a beautiful fish and I'll put him down as the fish to never touch because 
He's bad. He's a bad fish. All right. Um, what can I throw away here? I'll throw away steel scrap. Oh, yeah, I'd rather throw away one one supply of steel. All right, buy steel. All right. Oh, don't hold the friggin' fish. We're getting fishy bola every time. All right, let's get the fudge out of here. But yeah, I'm looking for these kind of waves. You see this little this little white thing above the water that indicates loot at nighttime. So you gotta look out for them. So that's why sometimes going out and looking for things at night is look. There's another one right here. Another one right here. All right. Let's uh let's have a look. Yeah, nighttime hunting for a chest is like fully viable. This one might be deeper than the other one though. All right. Uh, let's put the duct tape here again, and three, two, one, please no sharks. All right, down we go. All right, I don't want to die a fishy bola again. All right, what, oh, wow, we've got a big one here. All right, we need to be quick. We're going to die. 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 Console, don't care. I can only take one. Oh, uh, lighter. I, I, I need one, one item, one item that I can take home. Holy shit, we're about to die. All right, get the fork out of here. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, that was scary. Um... I didn't see anything there that I needed. I would go back down, but I'm kind of scared, and I'm not too sure if there's anything else I needed there. Um, so close to land, too. What was that? There was a there was a lighter. There was an axe and a hammer. I probably could have picked up that axe. Um, there was an engine thing, which I really don't give a shit about at this stage. Um, nah, there was more chests downstairs, I believe, but I couldn't find the entrance. Now, we're full up on inventory anyway. If you want me to go back to it, I'll go back to it in a future episode. But let's get back. Because Fishy Bola is setting into my hands. I've got purple dots. I don't like it. I've, I'm lost at sea. It took us a lot of episodes, but we're finally lost at sea. Um, that's not really an achievement, though. That's kind of a, <laughs> it's kind of boundable. I've gone the wrong direction. So this is the island. I'm pretty sure you meant to go south from the island, no? Let's go check them out and check if these are new. Yeah, let's at least check to see if these are new. And, hey, if there's some stuff, we might be able to fix our Ebola virus. Oh, my God, we're losing. We need to fix our Ebola virus stat. Oh, you've got the ladder. The middle one's got the ladder. All right. And just a little closer. Okay, that'll do for me. That'll do for me. All right, let's see if this is a new one. If this is a new one, that's good because we found uh, some new resources, but it's bad because we've lost and, uh, yeah, like actually lost. If we find one new item here, we know, we'll know immediately if it's a new or an old one. And it looks like the old one. Um, looks old. Looks old. Looks real old. Nothing new here. Yeah, I think this is the old one, which means we shouldn't be far away from our old place. Unless it's just really empty on that level for some reason. Nah, this is dead set the one. Alright, so, I think it's that island over there that is our home island. Yeah, this thing is empty as all hell. Empty as all hell. We're leaving this place. Let's go on the roof here. Remember the ladders, how they don't work? Yeah, they still don't work. Okay, so judging if this is the old one, we're not too far away from home. Uh, I would say that, that that's obviously not our island. That could be our island, or that could be our island. Um, now, when you looked at it, it was to the left. So that one actually made sense to be our island, because it was off to the left. Unless I'm looking at it on the wrong side of the island. We have to try these surrounding islands and find the one that is ours. Wish us luck. I'm going to start with this one right here. This could actually be it. Yeah, yeah, this could be it. It was really close. And it looked like that. Yeah, this this should be our island, I think. I think we just went past our island and went off to that one. We should be fine. All right, here we go. Here's our island. Oh, and there you go. Would you just look at that? That <laughs> We were so close. But I, I'm just glad we have not lost ourselves yet this season. And I think it's because of the amount of landmarks per island. Like, before there was no real landmarks. The red boxes are great landmarks for remembering which uh which place is yours and which place is not i just wish there was an entrance with the bay over here because now i have to like paddle my car across and there's the magic raft how are you today all righty we've got sticks and we've got lots of them but first we need to fix fishy bola all right let's get out of here and uh first off we need to put this bad boy somewhere all right i know i'm sick i'm gonna vomit again but i need to oh wait 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 wait, wait, wait. wait. Don't, do it again. Don't, do it again. don't do it again don't do it again don't do it again don't do it again i need to put him in a place put him right here i can move him around oh my days holy crap okay so let me check i guess i'll just keep using them until one of them works but i think it's vitamins i think i need vitamins let's see what have we got here i've got vitamins and i've got vitamins so vitamins better work or we're fucked vitamins don't work this is un friggin believable out of everything i've looted this whole series I don't have it. I need antibiotics. Antibiotics are the only thing that can fix me right now. And I don't have them. And you can't make them. So, I need to start looting ships or I'm going to die. That's... Wow. Okay. Alright. 
you need to be adequately named the Ebola fish, all right? Because you are just, like, I can't believe that. The Ebola fish has given us a disease that we can no longer fix, and I think my, my I think it's getting worse. It's red now. But the poisoning effect is caused by either consuming toxic food items or from stepping on or touching venomous creatures such as sea urchins or a lionfish. Players can cure themselves of the poisoning effects by consuming antibiotics. All right, so... We need to not step on that friggin' fish, or we're gonna get mad Ebola. Um, so I need to like zone you off. Can I do that? Is this is this touching? No, that's good. It's good. It's good. All right, you can uh, you can stay there for now. You've actually you pissed me off so hard. All right, so I'm gonna chuck my crabs here and cook them up. Um, a little bit of a storm. Uh, actually, I'm gonna use that. Yeah, I got one piece of wood. Yeah, stick over here. I'll just grab this stick over here and chuck it in. Um, yeah, very very disappointed to say the least. Um, and we're running to the end of the episode today. And uh, all I want to do was to simply. Go out and grab some, uh, some, some, some materials, and I came back with Ebola. I mean, I can't believe it. These lionfish, man, absolutely unreal. It, it did tell me though. It literally said I shouldn't be touching this, and I touched it, and then it made me get Ebola. I'm gonna need to go ahead and um, try and find a way to fix this bad boy. I guess um, I have to find the vitamins, and we're losing. We need food. Okay, it's it's a, the thing that doesn't make me too scared is that we lose. Um, we lose fluid loss, but fluid loss is just so good. Like you lose food much quicker than you lose uh, your actual uh, fluid loss. So I'm gonna drink both of these because maybe it might be like Minecraft and give you two. And then chuck the bucket of seawater over on the fire here. I think it lost a little bit in its serving size there. It lost multiple servings there. Okay, let me chuck it back in the thing. All right, it's filling up. It's filling up. It's filling up. And let's be careful not to lose any of its stuff. Perfect. All right, I uh, might need to move that over a little bit as well. All right, and we've got some cooked crabs to eat. So I'm going to have to need to eat these to actually work back my uh, my Ebola. Ugh. All right, and aside from that, let's actually do some little bit of building to wrap up today's episode. So we've got our sticks here. Um, just going to make sure to watch out for that thing. Uh, I'm going to go for a, uh, a nice little stick roof right here. I was thinking if I could do corrugated iron, but I think I'm out. I need one more piece of corrugated uh, scraps, because I need four pieces. Oh, I only have two? Okay, well, that's, uh, that's an issue. Um, so I could do a steel roof. Um, I think I might just do a wood roof for now. So let's do a wood stick floor roof right there. Finally getting some things done. So window, window. Let's close the door here, so I know what I'm working with. So I got window, window. I'm gonna need some half wood walls over here. Um, so let's go some walls. Half wood, wood wall, half wood wall. Oh, wow, it looks much cleaner and much cooler as well as the other ones. All right, let's put it, like, here. Oh, that looks so much better. It's got all those ferns in it and everything. That's so much better. Wow, I should have uh, should have checked for that thing, man. That's so much cooler. Oh, that's sick. Damn. All right, so wood stick wall there as well. And then I'll probably do a wood stick wall over here as well. It has to be symmetrical. Symmetry is key. All right, symmetry is so key. All right, so let's put a half wall there. Um, now, this is where it gets a little interesting because i want to try and keep this um i think i'll put a top wall up no nah, i think i'll just do another half wall because like i said symmetry's got to be key um and then i'll put more half walls all around here obviously i can still jump the half wall so like it's not too much of an issue if i like get annoyed with them um there we go and then another half wall over here um oh, watch that watch out for the ebola fish oh no it's not meant to go there unless i move the other one actually yeah let's move the other one it was kind of looking weird anyway all right Goodbye, Driftwood half wall that I made off screen that no one cares about. You're dead to me. All right, and there we go. We'll have just enough to complete this whole round. Uh, why can't that go there? Why can't it go there? Why can't it go there? Somebody explain to me why that cannot go there. I want to know why. Can this go here? Watch out for the ball of fish. Sometimes Stranded Deep just makes no sense for no reason. No reason at all. Will it go up here? I think it's maxed out on builds or something. Or I'm out of sticks. Maybe I'm out of sticks. Maybe I'm out of sticks. No, I have sticks. I have lots of them, actually. Oh, there we go. Oh, I just lost more hearts. Okay, that's great. All right, so look, there was just a little glitchy there. I don't know. It's working now, though, so thank thank, thank God for that one. All right, and... Lo oh, I can stack the half wood walls up to make a full wall. If I wanted to, that is. All right, I could probably mix and match the walls as well. Could I? I wonder... Let's grab some planks here. Can I make a plank wall? Uh, is plank wall a thing? It is It is a thing. Let's make a plank half wall here and see if I can chuck it. Oh, that is sick. Okay, so yeah, I can mix and match 
with the planks here. All right, so let's put uh, another half wood wall of plank here. Plank wall. I reckon the half wall is the way to go, so you can mix and match. Yeah, mix and match and make some cool things. You can put it. Oh, that's that's a full wall I put down. Uh, wall, uh, plank, half wall, and put one here. Alrighty, I like this. I can't do a tarp half wall though. I don't think can I? Can a tarp half wall been done? No, tarp wall. Dang it. All right. Well, I think that's uh, some good progress for our humble abode. Um, we've got three doors. Um, yeah. I, I actually I kind of like the door here now. I was at first I was like, why is this here? Now I'm like, this is sick. Um, yeah, we'll have a couple of windows. I'll probably fill in most of these half walls, but I'll leave a couple of them as windows. And uh, yeah, I think that is honestly a good point to wrap up today's episode. I hope you guys did enjoy today's episode of Strategy. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like down below. And hopefully next episode. We can uh, fix our disease. If you guys have any suggestions for hunting down that antibiotics, I would love your suggestions. Catch you guys next time. Later, guys.